Hello everyone, this is Eugene Fan speaking. It's time to do something that I haven't done in a while. A reaction video. Now for this video, it's going to be another trailer reaction, but it is on something really special because it seems that Toys for Bob has just released their official launch trailer for the Spiral Reignited Trilogy. I am so Oh, excited to see what this is all about. I have not seen any clips or anything like that, so this would be a great opportunity to see what they have in store for this. I have been waiting all year for this game, and now, yeah, finally time to see what they have in store. And so, let's get to the trailer, shall we? All right, let's get ready in three, two, one. Oh, there's the sheep. And there's Spyro right there. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Can't really hear what he's saying. Oh, was that? Yeah, I thought I saw Glimmer right there. Now, I know a lot of these are still on Spyro 1, which I haven't played yet. Oh, the, the skateboard. And the hockey <laughs> colossus. Oh my goodness. My goodness, the environments. Man, those those flame dudes look really different. Cloud spires. Oh my goodness. I mean, I, I haven't played Spiral 1 before, so it's going to be interesting. Okay, that's... I swear, Alora looks really different from her PS1 counterpart. There's the speedways. Her <laughs> freaking money backs. And there's Sheila. Nasty North, there's Idol Springs, and that freaking Yeti Heracross, there's Ripto. Um, okay, oh, that's Gal. My goodness, these character designs. Oh my goodness! <laughs> well, they showcased quite a bit. I was quite worried that they would only showcase a lot of things from Spiral 1 itself, but I did see a lot of things. Like, I saw, what was it, Cloud Spires, Idol Springs, Colossus with the hockey, the skateboard. I think that was um, Sunny Villa. But, oh my goodness, yes, yes. And the art of this game itself from this trailer it looks spectacular i'm really looking forward to seeing how all of these different characters how they differ because for one like i said alora from uh spiral 2 the fawn really looks so different honestly if they don't, did not mention that that was alora i would not have guessed it to be fair that is a much more realistic portrayal of what she's supposed to be. She is a fawn after all. Sheila doesn't look any much different. Um, Gulp, yeah, I can see some differences. And Ripto, wow, Ripto looks so scary. So much, much, so much more scarier than what he was in the PS1 version. Sure, we didn't get to see the full picture of everything. It's still a lot of surprises to be had and all, but this gives us an indication of what to expect and gameplay wise we don't really get to see much of it it's more of like showcasing how all of these different designs and all that are yeah i'm very excited to play the most important thing is the gameplay obviously so there's still a lot of things that are that can be put as surprises i haven't seen much gameplay from it i've seen like some of the earlier versions and i did think that they could use some adjustments and all that but i have been preventing myself from watching any gameplay footage or any like trailers and all that sort of stuff just so that when the time comes when the game finally comes out i can be you know i will be filled with surprises and not feel too underwhelmed really looking forward to this this was a great trailer and just all i can say is that I am super hyped. I am super hyped. I hope that, you know, with the whole recent thing with Bowsette and all that crazy thing that's been happening with Nintendo literally taking over the internet, I really hope that it doesn't overshadow Spyro when it finally comes out because 
I really want Spyro to be more popular among people. I know Spyro is probably not going to be as popular as Crash, as what I've seen so many times already. More people know about Crash Bandicoot, but if Spyro the Dragon can get the popularity as much as when Crash Bandicoot and Saint Trilogy came out, I would be absolutely over the moon because I freaking loved Spyro the Dragon 2 and 3. Those were some of my favorite games as a kid. And so reliving this, reliving the memory and playing the games all over again in their HD version on my PS4 is going to be absolutely amazing. I am so looking forward to this. And so I guess I'll leave this reaction video right there. Let me know in the comment section below how, what, what are your thoughts on the game and what are you expecting to find any improvements that could be made from previous um, gameplay trailers or anything like that if you guys have seen them. What do you want to see being kept or improved in the Reignited Trilogy? Let me know in the comment section below. Now again, I'll try to come out with some other videos for this month, but if nothing else, the Spyro the Dragon Reignited Trilogy gameplay will definitely be a thing that I will be doing next month. And so look forward to that. And so for now, as always, thank you guys so much for watching this video and do stay tuned to the next time of whatever I make. Until next time, bye.